Hello, and welcome to Random Play Assassin's Creed 3! Yes, I'm Phantom Savage! Yes, and welcome to Random Play Assassin's Creed 3! And before people ask, no, this is not an official Let's Play. It may or may not be a full LP. I don't know, it's not related to any storyline. For those of you that don't know, a Random Play, at least for me, means that I'm going to play this game as long as I can or until I get bored and considering I love all the Assassin's Creed games and have played through pretty much every single one except the DLC uh, I don't think I'm gonna get bored with this anytime soon so uh, let's randomly play this this is totally blind let's get going I can't wait to do this oh and uh, in case you're not up to date um <clears throat> last time on Assassin's Creed spoilers aliens Awesome. What the fuck? I can't control my body! Oh no. Oh no. Oh shit! Oh shit! Coma! New game! Starring Ezio again! Claudia, my dearest sister. I have been in Accra a week now, safe and in high spirits, but prepared for the worst. Coma be gone! Holy shit, our dad is Q! Holy shit, what the fuck? I don't even know! Let's, uh, let's get going. Uh, single player, start a new game. Ooh, name. Well, uh, let's see. Uh, we're an assassin in love of knives, right? Let's fear the great, great assassin named, I don't know, Bobby Ballstabber. He will not only stab you in the face, but stab you in the balls. Okay. <clears throat> Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up. Or laughed them off. Sometimes both. I still do. We took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning, with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage. One he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. Little known fact that Abstergo Industries actually own a chain of sports bars. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found. All of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group. The same group that now had Desmond. And others were owned by Steve Jobs. We know them as the Templars. As the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years. Even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. Even sex! Brown chicka brown brown! The way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils. Went the truth. We're trying to fix that. To free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do. And the Templars have the upper hand these days. Holy shit, the is that Agent 47? The assassins. 47's a Templar? I, I guess that makes sense, actually. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last. Everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him. Altair? To Desmond. We're doomed. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches. December 21st, 2020. What? None of us knows what it feel like, like I just walked into the movie this. knowing. They want us to be. So help me God if that's true, I better bump into Nicolas Cage. Guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. 
They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him. Aperture science? Us. He stands at the entrance to this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. Except he only knows how to use knives and parkour and not guns. He's not gonna be a very good assassin if he can only use knives. And, okay, well, anyway. What, what, what am I dancing to? Am I dancing to what is love up there? What the hell? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. I got a knife. <laughs> Hey, it's, uh, it's a little bright outside. It's, what, what's going on? Is Hiroshima two feet to the left? Oh god, you're about to hit that tree! Ah, okay! Can you see what you're doing up there? Because I, I can't. I, I, I really can't see what the hell's going on. Um, I can't do anything. I can't move at all. I guess, I guess I'm just supposed to sit here. You have got amazing vision. That or we're being drived by the blind. I really don't know. So, uh... Catch that Lakers game? It was, uh, it's cool. I, I, I met Jack Nicholson. He was... He's a, kind of a nice, crazy man. I... You know... Oh. Uh, okay. Um... Well? Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, let's just get out then. We're here. Where's here? Oh, I hate that silent treatment. It's so awkward when, you know, you've farted in the van and nobody wants to say anything. They don't want to s say anything that's, you know, the smelt it, dealt it deal, but just awkwardly roll down the windows and you feel bad. Let's go. Okay, Dad. So clearly have a good relationship with you. Oh, crap. I might need to uh, turn down my render settings a bit. It's lagging slightly. In fact, I'm going to do that right now. One second. Actually, I cannot. I cannot access the render options. Okay. I guess I'll just walk down here laggy then. All right, fine, whatever. I'll fix it in a second when the game will allow me. Oh my god, it's a sign. These must be left by our ancestors. It makes sense the precursor race would have access to graffiti. Oh. I, I was joking. Uh, I guess I'll just put it here. Now, I've got to say, the dialogue is really well written in this game so far. In another moment, down went Alice after it. Never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. <laughs> I love him. Alright, if you see any smoking caterpillars, let me know. I'll stab that fucker like it was a nothing. Uh, okay. Oh, this is a rather uniform, neat cave. It's a very rare type of cave. These were made by ancient people. Uh, cavemen, I think. Alright. Okay, this this is looking more like it. What's in the boxes? Hello? I guess I'm just gonna walk this way then and yeah, okay. Handy dandy flashlight, isn't it? Hmm. I think we're here. No, totally. We're not here at all! We still got 
40 miles to go. We were, we we're like in the totally wrong place. Oh, whoa. I, 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 did you just drop the piece of Eden? It looked like you. Oh, no. That was. Okay. I can't seem to do anything about the lag. I can't change the settings. I, I checked the main menu temporarily and it. Ah, whatever. Hopefully it won't get too bad. Wait a minute. This isn't White Castle. Damn it. Hey, guys, come down here. It's just a simple slide down. I'm sure you'll be fine, old man. Be good for your back, I swear. Kind of massaged mine. Along with the jagged rocks that kind of shoved into my ass. No, all right, I'll just leave you guys back there. I, oh, I should watch my stuff. All right, then. Uh, okay, let's see. Deep within the ruins of Aperture Science, Aperture Industries had a secret facility underground. Oh my god, it's a glowing Lego brick! <gasps> the Old Spark! Optimus Prime, transform! Oh. Wait a minute, that's not the Autobots! Oh no, Decepticon! No, whatever. And no one noticed this over a thousand years. You've activated the Stargate. Hold it. Ah! Hey! The key. You must find the key. Oh, what, so the apple isn't the key? Son. You're not my di What the fuck?! Uh. You, uh... You changed! Here we go again. Uh, uh, what?! Another coma, are you kidding me?! Desmond? Do you hear us? No. Uh, yeah. What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding Wait, you can hear me? Collapsed and entered into a fugue state. Wait, how are you talking so to me, naturally, then? naturally, you dropped me into the Animus. Oh. Of, I don't know, making sure I was okay. <laughs> you weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you. And I didn't want to risk severing the connection. Thanks, Dad. not until we knew what it wanted. You're such a caring father. Of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. This is why I left, I damn it! What I'm looking for, by the way. It's a key. There's no idea where it is, though. Well, it's somewhere out here. I guess that's why she triggered the bleeding effect. She? Cortana. Juno, Dad. Yeah. She's talking to me. You know, the alien chick. Oh, here we go. Okay, Desmond, while you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. I'd like to run a couple of quick tests, make sure there aren't any major issues. Oh, the tutorial level, you mean? <laughs>